Do you know how easy it is to export a high-res PDF from InDesign, which is print ready? Well, in this tutorial, it's exactly what I'm going to show you how to do today with all the presets and settings needed. For those who don't know me, my name is Darren Goddard. I've been working in creative production for over 20 years now. And in these tutorials, I aim to help fellow creators become more productive within InDesign, Photoshop, Illustrator, and various other softwares. Well, that's enough about me. Let's jump into the video. So in InDesign, with your document open, you need to go up to File, Export. This will then open up a window to where you want to save your PDF to. So I've got my tutorial, so you hit Save. This then brings up the dialog box for all the settings. It defaults to high quality print. For this purpose, for the high res print PDF, we need to go to this one here. This is a 1.3 PDF compatible with most printers. We then go to compression and here it will basically compress images above 450 ppi down to 300 ppi which will make it better for print and a smaller file. Marks and bleed. This is where we can add our crop marks, our registration marks, page information along with bleed settings and a slug. The slug is an area down the bottom of the page if you want to add any extra information like who's created the file. Bleed, it's taken it from the document. I've added 10 mil to the document, and that's why it's, it's say, taken the 10 mil. Be careful here because if you don't change the offset to 10 mil, you'll end up having your um, trim marks in your bleed. Output, this is where you can do a color conversion but normally you want to stick with the colour in, the colour out. So we'll select no colour color conversion. Advanced, transparency flattener. This is if you use transparency in your document, so we'll keep this on high. OPI, this is if you're swapping out low res images in a RIP. Security, here you've got the option to add a password to the PDF. For the next people who open it, they'll have to put a password in. Then you get your summary. So we'll export that, should be done by now. So we'll just go to the window. So here we have the PDF, open that up. to zoom out a little bit. So now you can see you've got trim mark, created by Darren, which was in the slug. And that's how you export a PDF for print from Adobe InDesign. If this video has been helpful, please consider giving me a like and subscribing to the channel for more content showing you tips and tricks of how to become more creative and productive within various software. If you would like this tutorial in a PDF format, please comment PDF in the comment box below and I'll send it over to you. Thanks and keep creating. Click on this video next for more productivity tips within InDesign.